So you're a private detective? I'm licensed. I do favors for people. In return, they give me gifts. So, what can I do for you? Liam, pleasure to meet you. Congratulations on the film. For those who don't know anything about it, what do you think audiences are going to expect from this one? Um, I think a very powerful thriller will keep you hopefully on the edge of your seat. Someone's kidnapped my wife. I pay them, but they killed her anyway. I want you to find the men who did this and bring them to me. Whoever it was took your wife didn't just pick your name out of a hat. They've been following her. You know your schedule. They've done this before. And they're going to do it again. He's broken, looking for redemption, and um, maybe not finding it. He's an ex-NYPD policeman. Why aren't you a cop no more? One shot. Well, the bullet took a bad hop. He seems like he's in the mold of, of kind of classic private detectives. Yeah, I thought it was a Robert Mitchum sort of, uh, that, that was who I grew up with as a teenager watching. Maybe in the 60s, uh, Steve McQueen, I guess, and Clint Eastwood. That's kind of iconic character, you know. Uh, the corruption got to you, huh? Not really. It would have been hard to support my family without it. He's a bit of a loner. Would it be fair to say that you get drawn to some of those characters a bit? I guess I do. I like them. They, I find them appealing to me in lots of ways. And I'm not a loner myself, but I, uh, I, I do find that appealing. These guys that are just out, not them. And they're, they have one foot on either side of the righteous and the justice and the other foot's in the enemy camp. And he's always treading a, a moral gray area. So what, you gonna stab me now with that big knife? It's gonna bother me too, for a long time. I know it will. How much is it gonna bother you? I take that knife away and stick it in your neck. Could you really do that? Yeah, I really could, but I'd rather not. You're seen as this sort of action hero now. Mm -hmm. Do you feel that people look to you if there was an incident? Would, would there be an expectation for you to step in? In real life? In real life. It hasn't happened yet. <laughs> no, but uh, no, I just keep it for the silver screen. In my eyes, indisposed, in disguises, no one knows. How can I find them? People are afraid of all the wrong things. Now, once they're in the van, they're just body parts. Ah! You dealt with situations like this? Not like this.